The software houses have had a, a problem with our machine and with, say, the Apple Macintosh because the 68000 chip was a lot to bite off. It's a very much more powerful chip than the Z80 that we've used previously or the 6502 that Apple have used previously. It's a very powerful chip indeed, and it's taken the software houses longer than we or Apple expected to come to terms with it. The exciting thing is, and the other side of the coin is, that having achieved that, having got, come to terms with it, they're producing some very dramatic software indeed.